Welcome, one and all, to BookNook, your ultimate destination for insightful and engaging book reviews. We journey through the pages of a wide range of books, offering in-depth analysis and thought-provoking insights. Our mission is simple, to light the spark of love for reading in your hearts and minds, one book at a time. We cater to all, from casual readers to avid bookworms. Stay tuned as today we dive into a fascinating exploration of Ray Dalio's Principles for Dealing with the Changing World Order, Why Nations Succeed and Fail. Now before we delve into the book, let's first get acquainted with the brilliant mind behind it, Ray Dalio. A titan in the world of finance, Dalio is the founder of Bridgewater Associates, one of the largest and most successful hedge funds in the world. Born in the hustle and bustle of New York City, Dalio's journey from playing jazz to becoming a financial maestro is a tale of grit, determination, and an insatiable curiosity for understanding the complexities of the world economy. Over the years, Dalio has penned several works with his book, Principles, Life and Work, becoming a New York Times bestseller. His writings reflect his extensive knowledge and expertise in economics, drawn from decades of experience in the financial sector. Dalio's unique approach to understanding economic cycles and predicting shifts in the world order has made him a respected figure in global economics. With such a dynamic personality authoring this book, it's no surprise that it offers deep insights into the world's changing economic order. Embarking on our journey through the book, the first few chapters lay the groundwork for understanding the economic principles at play. Ray Dalio's Principles for Dealing with the Changing World Order, Why Nations Succeed and Fail, is a deep dive into the machinations of global economies, and the opening chapters set the stage for this exploration. The first chapter, aptly titled The Big Picture, introduces us to Dalio's overarching theme, the cyclical nature of global economies. Dalio posits that understanding these cycles can help predict the rise and fall of nations, providing a strategic advantage to those who can harness this knowledge. Next, Dalio delves into the mechanics of empires in the second chapter. Here, he presents a fascinating analysis of the historical patterns that have led to the ascent and decline of world powers. He argues that economic strength, competitiveness, and debt cycles are the key factors that determine a nation's success or failure. In the third chapter, Money, Credit, and Debt, Dalio dissects the concept of money. He explains how it is created, how it circulates in an economy, and how it influences the rise and fall of empires. This chapter is particularly enlightening as it breaks down complex economic concepts into digestible nuggets of wisdom. Moving on to the fourth chapter, The Archetypical Big Debt Cycle, Dalio presents a detailed examination of debt cycles. He discusses the causes, stages, and consequences of these cycles, providing insights into how they have shaped the world order in the past and how they might continue to do so in the future. Finally, the fifth chapter, The Three Stages of a Big Debt Cycle, further elaborates on the ideas presented in the previous chapter. Dalio outlines the three stages of a debt cycle, the early, middle, and late stages, and explains how each stage impacts the economy of a nation. As we progress, Dalio's adept handling of complex economic concepts becomes increasingly evident. Stay tuned as we continue our journey through the remaining chapters in the next segment. We continue our exploration with the following chapters shedding light on the rise and fall of nations. In the subsequent chapters, Dalio delves into the intricate dynamics that govern global power shifts. He insightfully illustrates how a nation's economic health is intrinsically tied to its political stability and the policy decisions it makes. The author points out the importance of education, infrastructure, and technological innovation in the rise of a nation. Conversely, he highlights how corruption, political instability, and lack of foresight can lead to a nation's downfall. Moving forward, Dalio presents a fascinating analysis of the economic cycles that have shaped the world order. He examines the rise and fall of empires, the impact of war and peace, and the influence of global trade on the prosperity of nations. This analysis is not just historical, as he also projects these cycles into the future, providing a thought-provoking look at potential global shifts. In the following chapters, the author delves into the importance of debt cycles and their influence on the global economy. He emphasizes how excessive debt can lead to economic crises and sheds light on the role of central banks in managing these cycles. Dalio also discusses the importance of understanding the concept of money and credit and how their misuse can lead to financial disasters. 
Subsequently, Dalio discusses the role of leadership in the success or failure of nations. He argues that strong visionary leaders can steer nations towards prosperity, while poor leadership can lead to economic decline and social unrest. The author also emphasizes the importance of a nation's cultural values and social harmony. He illustrates how societal cohesion and a shared sense of purpose can contribute to a nation's success, while divisiveness and social conflict can hinder its progress. In the concluding chapters of this section, Dalio explores the concept of adaptability. He posits that nations that can adapt to changing circumstances and evolve with the times are more likely to succeed, while those resistant to change may falter. Dalio's insightful analysis provides us with a greater understanding of the world's economic landscape. As we approach the end of the book, Dalio's principles become increasingly pertinent. In the final chapters, Dalio expands upon his principles for dealing with the changing world order. These principles, drawn from a deep study of history and economics, are the bedrock of his predictions for the future. First, Dalio emphasizes the importance of understanding the big picture. He suggests that we should not get lost in the minutia of daily events, but instead strive to comprehend the broader trends and cycles that shape our world. These macro-level patterns, Dalio argues, are the key to predicting and successfully navigating the future. Next, Dalio highlights the need for adaptability. The world order is in a constant state of flux, and those who remain rigid in their thinking and approaches are likely to be left behind. Dalio encourages us to embrace change, remain open-minded, and continuously learn and adapt in order to stay afloat in this fast-paced world. Furthermore, Dalio underlines the importance of strategic decision-making. He suggests that decisions should not be made in isolation, but rather by considering their potential impacts on the wider system. This systemic thinking, Dalio argues, allows us to make more informed and effective decisions. Finally, Dalio emphasizes the value of resilience. He points out that setbacks and challenges are inevitable in a changing world order. However, those who can maintain their resolve, learn from their mistakes, and bounce back stronger are the ones who will thrive in the long run. These principles are not just applicable to nations, but also to individuals, businesses, and other entities. They serve as a guide to navigate the uncertainties and complexities of the future. Dalio leaves us with much to ponder about the future of our world's economic order. By understanding and applying these principles, we can better prepare ourselves for the inevitable changes to come and play a proactive role in shaping the future. Having navigated through Dalio's insightful narrative, let's revisit some of the key points that stood out. Firstly, the book underscores the importance of understanding the larger picture. It's not just about economics, but how history, politics, and culture intertwine to shape the global economic landscape. Dalio takes us on a journey through time, underscoring the cyclical nature of empires and their economic might, which is as fascinating as it is enlightening. Secondly, Dalio puts a spotlight on debt cycles, both short-term and long-term, and their pivotal role in determining the economic health of nations. His emphasis on the significance of managing these cycles gives us a new lens to view and understand economic fluctuations. Thirdly, the author introduces the concept of beautiful deleveragings, a delicate balance between deflation and inflation. It's a complex but crucial idea that can potentially alter the course of a falling economy if handled well. Lastly, Dalio's principles are not just theories, but are derived from meticulous study and personal experience. They serve as a practical guide for anyone interested in understanding the mechanics of economies and their impact on our lives. In essence, Dalio's principles for dealing with the changing world order stretch beyond the realm of economics. They delve into the heart of societal evolution, making it a must-read for anyone eager to comprehend the world around them. Dalio's principles for dealing with the changing world order indeed provides us with a fresh perspective on global economics. As we wrap up our review of Dalio's enlightening book, we hope it has piqued your interest. His examination of the shifting world order and the reasons why nations rise and fall is a treasure trove of insight, wisdom, and thought-provoking ideas. His book isn't just a read, it's an experience, an intellectual journey that challenges us to look at the world from a different perspective. We've explored the book's chapters and key takeaways, but there's so much more for you to discover. Its depth and breadth are truly admirable, offering a unique blend of history, economics, and philosophy. It's a book that deserves a place on your bookshelf to be read, reread, and pondered upon.
So if you haven't yet, we highly recommend picking up a copy and diving into the world Dalio has so meticulously crafted. It promises to be an enlightening adventure. Don't forget to subscribe to Booknook for more such engaging reviews. Happy reading!